Yo, yo, what's going on, YouTube? I uh, just wanted to get a quick video out, man. I'm not a YouTuber or anything, but I uh, felt like this is important that the community uh, needed to know since um, everybody's on the Trovo wave right now. Um, so what I'm actually going to show you guys today is how to get your Trovo chat into Streamlabs OBS. Um, because as of right now, um, Trovo's all web or mobile based it's not integrated in the stream labs but uh, I did figure out a way to get your um, your trouble chat showing into stream labs so you don't have to toggle between stream labs um, to you know um, play around with the stream and all of your elements and also uh, toggle between um, the Trovo website to uh, keep up with the chat and everything so um, the first thing that you want to do is on the Trovo site, um, as you can see, everything's web based. I haven't streamed today, so um, my chat is pretty empty. But um, as you can see, here's uh, just some people that came into my channel and followed me. I wrote a test message, but uh, what you want to do is go into chat settings and pop out chat so it pops out as a new window so as you can see here it doesn't show like the people that came in but it does show my message and uh, what you want to do is grab this URL here so I'm just gonna control C and copy that and then in Streamlabs OBS um, this is the default layout I use for Twitch uh, it actually worked for me just because when you stream to Twitch, um, it actually adds your Twitch chat to the right hand side. But um, for everyone that streamed in Trovo or uh, will be streaming in Trovo, um, that chat side, it does not show like your viewer count or your um, chat during your Trovo stream. But uh, so what you want to do in Streamlabs OBS is this third icon down at the bottom uh, side on the left is Layout Editor. So you have your editor display, which is what's showing uh, on your game with your overlay and everything, uh, your mini feed um, for Twitch. It shows, you know, if someone joined, if someone rated you, things like that. Uh, then you have uh, your different elements, your scene selector, your source selector, your audio mixer. Uh, you can actually add a tab here and save different layouts, but I'll just create this one from editor, which is default. So, um, what do you actually want to do? I'm going to replace the chat with the mini feed just to show you guys how it looks and then show you a couple different layouts that you guys can try. So what you want to do is grab website and drag it here, um, to replace whichever element, uh, in here, it'll be the mini feed. And then you want to paste that URL here under website. And then you want to hit save changes and it will actually reload and as you can see it actually has that test message that I wrote um, just to show you guys I'll actually just type in test here just to show you guys that it works um, and now you see that other message where it says test um, this particular view or layout doesn't work for me just because of uh, it's going to take up too much real estate. I like to see what's on the screen uh, while I'm streaming. So in layout editor, what you actually can do is um, I'm just going to select this one here where it has the, the website on the left hand side. And then I'm going to hit save changes here. It's going to refresh. So as you can see, it has the chat here on the left hand side. Um, the only thing about this layout is that you can't change the size of like your gameplay window or your, you know, your, your game monitor, PC window, browser, whatever you're showing on your uh, console or your PC. But um, I feel like this, you can actually see more. Uh, as far as the elements that you have in your stream and you can also show the uh, chat here so uh, as I said before I'm not a youtuber but um, I felt like this is something important 
that uh, needed to get out there as soon as possible. Um, oh, the one thing that I did notice about this is with Twitch, you can see your viewers and everything. I noticed with this, it may be just because it's web based that once you go to your uh, viewers here, this X will not take you back to the chat window. So you actually have to go back to layout editor, hit save. And it's just going to reload your chat. So that's small bug. Um, but I just wanted to put that out there as far as what I've noticed. I haven't played around with this much just because I literally just figured this out and wanted to hurry up and make this video. But um, please let me know what you guys think. Um, as I said before, I'm not a YouTuber, but, uh, who knows, man, I may figure out a lot of other things and you may get a lot more content from me, but, um, yeah, make sure you like the video, subscribe to my channel. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, a Y the creator everywhere, a Y T H a creator, uh, Twitch, Trovo, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, PlayStation, that's my PSN name, that's my gamer tag. Um, so, AY the creator everywhere. Um, I hope you guys have a great day, and uh, hopefully, you guys find this useful. All right.